Well, the Eddies are over, and the male and female student athletes of the year have been named. We're standing with the female student athlete of the year, Desamba Franklin. First of all, Desamba, congratulations. Uh, did you have any idea you were even up for the award? I was completely shocked, completely shocked, and it, was, it took me by total surprise. Well, the numbers you put up this season, very impressive. Six home runs to end the season. Your last year here in North Carolina Central. Uh, just talk about why were you so successful here this, this final year? I would have to say that I kept focused. Um, my teammates were very, very supportive, and we hung in there together. Is, is there a game this season that, that comes to mind as far as uh, performing well on the field? Um, I would have to say... Not one in particular. I would have to say maybe NC State. That was my first home run over the fence. With you being a senior and you're headed out to graduate now in a couple weeks, um, is this sort of a crowning achievement uh, to, to cap off your career here at North Carolina Central? I would have to say so, definitely. Well, congratulations on the award, and we wish you the best of luck in your future endeavors. Thank you, you too. That's Desamba Franklin, the 2009-2010 Female Student Athlete of the Year. Well, the 2009-2010 season almost over here at North Carolina Central as far as athletics. We named the 2009-2010 Male Student Athlete of the Year. He's on the football team. He does it both on the field and in the classroom. Terrell White is your winner. Terrell, first of all, congratulations on the award. And uh, did you have any idea you were even up for it? I had no idea. I was actually a little uh, upset because we had the defensive MVP for football. We had the overall team MVP. And I was nominated for one, but I was fearing that I made a little joke at the beginning. If you didn't work hard this year, better luck next year. I was going to place myself in my own category, so I'm glad I got something in the end. Well, when you look back at the season, is there a game in particular that really stands out for you? Uh, I would say the Appalachian State game. I feel like I had a really good game there, dominated, and um, I'm looking forward to repeating this upcoming season. Overall, uh, when you look at the whole year, football, the progress you're making at this point, um, does it make you pretty excited for next season? Oh, yeah, it does, man. And with the draft just recently uh, passed, I'm really excited, trying to see what my chances were, where I needed to improve, listening to the ESPN analysts. And uh, it just builds up a lot of excitement for the upcoming season. I was ready to work out right after the draft came, man. Just won the Student Athlete Male of the Year Award. Um, it seems like uh, you're, you're proving to everyone that you got to do it on both the field and in the classroom. Just talk about uh, your, your, I guess, your mindset into that. Okay, well, like I said, my father always told me to have as many irons in the fire as possible. So from day one, it was the classroom first. I didn't start playing sports until I was about, I started when I was five playing t-ball, but uh, really got serious, I guess, in the end of elementary school, but it was always, if you don't have your grades right, you're not even going to be able to play. So I knew how bad I wanted to play, so I always knew how to put the importance first on school and then secondary on academic, I mean, uh, athletics. All right, Terrell, congratulations on the award, and uh, best of luck this summer as you get ready for the 2010 football season. All right, I can't wait, man. Thank you. That was Terrell White, the 2010 Male Student Athlete of the Year here at North Carolina Central.